to get your service revolver, your Glock in this case. Question? I got yeah. one question. Why are the, the bar police officers available to have guns? Why, 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 why aren't they available to have mace? Mace is a deterrent. That means once you get sprayed with mace in your eyes, you, you cannot do anything else but Absolutely. hurt your eyes. Okay, why are the uh, bar police officers able to carry guns. If, if you are riding the bar, okay, this is a public event. There are public people and there are public property. Yeah. These are not Oakland police officers. Right. These are not Oakland trained police officers. Yeah. These were contracted police by bar. You understand? So that means they have guidelines to go by to do this type of thing actually make our own flight worthwhile because I am Oscar Grant. You are Oscar Grant. Your children yeah. are Oscar Grant. Right. You know, we have to actually serve more of our purpose and go to the, the court of transportation, to the Supreme Court of Justice, and you have to keep going. You can't just stop when everything seems okay. You have to keep going. You have to make the policy for the police officers to change. Yep. You have to make different policies. Oscar Grant and some of the other detainees stood up 
and became verbally abusive to Peroni and his partner, Dominici. Peroni approached Grant and forced him to the floor of the platform. At this point, several additional officers, including Officer Meserly, arrived on the platform. What we just saw was Meserly already there. Right, yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah. He's already there. He's already dealing with the people. This is the prosecutor's statement. Well, does he watch the same video? He watches the same video as us. He's running the Okay, let's cut this 
I just want to say a couple of things. We're investigating who Messerly is. We found out some information that we need to verify about members of his family being a part of racist websites and conversations. We think that this goes beyond the action of a single criminal. We think that this was a political, ideological, racist policeman working with another ideological, political, racist policeman. We intend to try to find out this information. And I just ask this, before we turn to Mr. Carruthers, so you can hear more about Meserly and about the Bart police, and you can get the answer to this gentleman's question, which is they should be disarmed once and for all because they're dangerous. And it's dangerous to shoot somebody on the platform of a subway. Who thinks about shooting somebody with a subway right nearby and this bullet ricochets? I mean, it's just crazy. So we're going to come to that. But just before, as people are leaving, please take extra copies of stuff. We're having a rally and a demonstration on March 23rd. And please make sure you get up on the BAM sign-up sheet. If you hear anything, if anyone talks to you, get in touch with us. Our phone number is on there. Please, please, please become a part of this fight and stay in it. Stay in it from here on in.